Hey guys, welcome back to Maison Molly. I'm Ash Molly, and today we're gonna be trying a new fall recipe I'm sure you've never had before. But of course guys, before we get into the video, don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. You guys can also find me over on Instagram and TikTok where I make daily coffee recipe videos. If that's something you're interested in, you can find me right here. Also guys, I'm like 15 subscribers away on TikTok from being a part of their creator program. So if you haven't, click the link down below and subscribe on TikTok too. Let's make a salted vanilla pumpkin spice macchiato. Alrighty guys, so you've heard it. Today we are making a salted vanilla pumpkin spice macchiato. It's fall time here in San Diego. Not really, it's fall everywhere else. So instead of making this one warm, we are gonna make it iced. I'm still in a linen shirt, like it's super hot outside. Uh, but nevertheless, I'm really, really excited for this recipe. You guys know I'm really into savory and sweet. Um, if I can share some of my favorite savory and sweet syrups with you, it would be the Monin Salted Caramel followed up by the Tarani salted egg yolk, and now the one we're using for this video, hold on, the new Tarani vanilla salt. Check it out guys, vanilla salt. Yep, we are gonna pair this back to the season's favorite, some pumpkin spice, and we're gonna make a macchiato. Let's get started. Alrighty guys, so for this recipe, we're gonna be needing a few ingredients, which I'm gonna share with you throughout, but the pot that we're gonna be using is the new Nespresso Pumpkin Spice Cake from the original line. I do think though that there are so many other pods that would be great with this recipe. For example, I would use something a little bit more intense next time, like a double espresso Chiaro or a Dia Voluto, just because this drink is so sweet and I truly feel that something stronger would definitely cut through the sweetness so first we're gonna go ahead and brew a double shot up and then I'm gonna let it sit and cool for a little bit that our espresso is ready let's go ahead and assemble this drink the first recipe item we're gonna be using is the Tarani pumpkin pie sauce. Oh my God, guys, it's so good. You just layer a little bit on your glass, add a little bit extra on the bottom, and then you will be good to go. Next, I'm gonna go ahead and add some ice, ice of your choice. I tend to pick up my ice at Chick-fil-A. I don't know why, but I love their shaved ice. It's pretty good. And then the star of the show, the Tarani Pyramid Vanilla Salt. Guys, I'm loving this syrup so far. Tarani was nice enough to send it over to me and I think it's like absolutely delish. Perfect between sweet and salty. Next, one tablespoon of also Tarani Pyramid Pumpkin Spice Syrup. Really good stuff. It's been my favorite pumpkin spice syrup for the last year. Have you guys tried this syrup before? What's your favorite pumpkin spice syrup? Drop it in the comments down below and let me know. You guys see, easy part, we're adding six ounce of milk to my glass and then after this, we're just gonna go ahead and top it off with our double shot of espresso. Macchiatos are so easy to make, I love them. Now it's time to get a little fancy. I got this whip from Target. It's a pumpkin spice flavored whipped cream, so super delicious. And then after the whip, we're gonna go in again with our pure made pumpkin pie sauce. How does it look? Is it looking good? <laughs> We're gonna add a straw and guys, that's pretty much it. We are done with this vanilla salt pumpkin spice macchiato. Alrighty guys, and here we've got it, a salted vanilla pumpkin spice macchiato. It was super easy to make. Um, I can't wait to try it, let's see. I tend to know when I'm gonna love things already and I just know this is gonna be a hit because I have tried 
all of these things independently, just not together. So let's see. It's like, it's, it's like a dessert, really. Mmm. Mm-hmm. And for all the people that are going to come for us in the comments and say, oh my gosh, that's not coffee, mind your business. We're going to enjoy it the way we want to enjoy it, okay? Mmm. Yes, yes. This is really good. Definitely not something that you can have on an everyday basis, but the flavors are there. You can taste, um, you can really taste the Tarani pumpkin pie sauce. You can taste the saltiness from the vanilla. This drink is popping. And then of course you've got the Target pumpkin spice whip for the top. This is where it's at. This is definitely where it's at. Only suggestion I would say if you don't want it as sweet, maybe half a tablespoon of um, the salted vanilla syrup and then half a tablespoon of the pumpkin spice syrup and you'll be good to go. I'm like dripping all over my floor. But this is freaking amazing. Like I, I just absolutely love it. I'll link the recipe down below for you guys and just remember like I said before, for daily recipes like this one, you guys can find me over on Instagram at Maison Molly. You guys, drop it in the comments down below. Let me know, have you tried the new Tarani Vanilla Salt Syrup yet? Well, it's called, yeah, Vanilla Salt Syrup yet. I think it's absolutely delish. You can order it through their website or I was told it's going to be in World Market in October if you wanted to wait. But the syrup, it's pretty amazing. As always guys, thank you for stopping by Maison Molly and I'll see you guys next time.